Hey, what's going on, family? It is Thick Chick Vlogs. Please make sure you start this video off by clicking that thumbs up button for me, okay? And make sure you go over and subscribe to my work at home job channel if you just so happen to be interested in um, work at home jobs, okay? Uh, family, let me tell you guys, as you can see from the title, this is going to be a Thrifters Anonymous type of video. Yes, ma'am. And yes, sirs, it is going to be a Thrifters Anonymous video. We are about to go to the thrift store and we are about to just um, be girls, okay? I put it on my personal Facebook page yesterday that I really need a thrifting buddy. It ain't even got to be somebody who's willing to go and spend a whole lot of money thrifting. It ain't even got to be that. Just somebody who want to go with me and, you know, we can put on stuff and, you know, just be girls. Just be girls sit around for hours thrifting and chatting it up. You know, it ain't got to be nothing extra okay it ain't gotta be nothing extra but i'm serious okay so if you are in the tuscaloosa alabama area tuscaloosa alabama okay tuscaloosa alabama what i'm gonna need you to do i'm gonna need you to leave a comment in the description box below in the description box in the comment box below let me know you in tuscaloosa alabama and you want to go thrifting with me girl you know what i'm saying just girls going thrifting and stuff finding you know unique stuff you know putting it on you guys I recorded an outfit the other day. You can see this ensemble. I record, well, okay, let me put it like this. I recorded the outfit of the day, but I'm not going to upload it. I felt so damn bad. Family, I'm pretty sure all of us girls have had a fat day. And when I say a fat day, I'm pretty sure we all know what fat days are. Those are the days to where, you know, we look in the mirror and we're like, oh, we look good. And then we snap a picture and we're like, damn. My back don't look right in there. You know what I'm saying? Like, somewhat right. I even put on this. It's hot as shit. I put on this little sweater thing. It's not a thick sweater. It's a very, very light sweater. It's kind of like an office sweater, but most people would wear if they work in an office and it gets a little chilly or whatever. It's not so hot to where I need to take it off. But I put on this because my arms are kind of out and I just felt, I felt fat. Okay? So, I had to throw something on my arms because I didn't feel like changing clothes and all that stuff. I mean, I recorded a full outfit a day. And once I look back at it, I was like, I'm, I'm not gonna upload this because I just, I don't, I, I don't think I look right. Okay. Even though my honey was like, you know, you look good. You know, you're sexy. You look good in that you are rocking that. But you know how dudes be there. Probably don't want to hurt your feelings. Even though, you know, I kind of looked in the mirror again and I took a couple of pictures and I looked right, but I just didn't think I looked right in the video. So y'all won't be seeing that outfit today. No, honey. And I don't today, you won't. If I just so happen to find a mirror when I am in the first store, whatever, a long, full leaf mirror, you know, I might let you guys get a get a glimpse of what I got going on here, but it ain't nothing spectacular. So, yeah, that's what's going on. The first place that we are going to go, I'm going to go to the post office, and hopefully they have, um, I have an invitation to a meet and greet that my girl, um, MK and BK, let, I keep getting your name wrong, slap me, okay? Slap me with a stupid stick on today because I keep getting your name wrong. But you know who I'm talking about, girl. I'm headed to the post office and you're going to be in there with me. Okay, because I'm going to take you in there with me to see if these folks got the damn uh, 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 the invitation in there. Cause they bullshitting on today. Okay, because they were even late putting the mail in the boxes on yesterday. They didn't even put the mail in the boxes until like 2 something. And they were supposed to put it in there around 1. I mean, I'm sorry, around 11. So they were a couple of hours late. I mean, I know that the United States Postal Service be laying folks off things, but come on, y'all gotta do better. This ain't no extra small city the way y'all could have one or two people working at the post office, okay? But I don't know about your post office, but in mine, a lot of times when I go in the post office, it's, if, if you got some shit to mail, boo boo, you gonna be in there waiting for a minute because the line be extra long because they don't really have nobody in there. Be one or two people at the counter and it, the lines be super duper long. So. That's what's going on. As you can see over here, Pam, this is our old mall, and they're doing some demolition over here, and it is going to be a huge, huge shopping center. So let's hope and pray that they put like a Burlington Co Factory or a Marshalls or something like that in that freaking shopping center because, girl, 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 when I tell you off the motherfucking chain, that's why I say, like, my honey, he was like, you know, because I, I told you guys I'm looking for a job outside of the house. He was like, you know, if you want to look for your job outside of the house, he was like, that's fine. He said, but he said, the Lord's going to elevate me to where, you know, I can get a better job, make it even more money, which he makes a decent living now. He said, uh, he's going to elevate me to where I can make more money to where you're going to be able to just do nothing. And I'm like, no, I don't want to do nothing because I want to go thrifting. You know what I'm saying? I want to use my money to thrift with. You know what I'm saying? I understand what you say. You want to be the man. You want to pay the bills, all that good stuff. Cool. But I'm still, okay. 
I'm still going to uh, go get my job so I can use my money to go thrift and things, you know. And plus, like I said in my last video, family, our Kmart is um, going out of business. Well, not our main Kmart. We have a Kmart in my city, which is Tuscaloosa, and we have another Kmart, which is right across the bridge in Northport. Okay, Northport is the place I told you about in the ghost story. If you didn't watch my last video, you need to go and watch it, okay? I told you guys about some scary shit that happened to me when I was 16 years old. Yes, ma'am. But it's in Northport, which is about five, 10 minutes away from here. They are going out of business. So on next week, they're going to be liquidating all of their shit and family. You already know, I gotta go in there and I gotta go ham and cheese on their makeup, their clothes, their um, housewares. I do need some more uh, pots and pans because I notice a lot of times I have a whole lot of dishes, but I notice when I'm cooking, I run out of pots and pans to cook in, so I gotta wash and sit out, and then you know I ain't got time for all that. So I gotta find me some more pots and pans utensils like houseware decor and stuff like that yeah it's about to go down up in the kmart in northport alabama on next week okay you will see if you are just so happy to be up in there you may see thick chick vlogs because so if you see me up in there with my camera and things speak you know what i'm saying don't don't hesitate you know i'm a little shy and things but if you see me up with this damn camera like this because i don't give a damn no more i really don't give a damn so if you see me up in the kmart with my camera and things y'all gonna need to you know holler at your girl speak say hey what's up thick chick vlogs you know what i'm saying girl, like, girl, what's up girl you know maybe you could be my new thrifty buddy or whatever all of that stuff and stuff shout out to my boy mr bugatti on instagram but anyway let me put this camera down so I can get on over here to this damn post office and I will see you guys when I get inside. Hopefully I'm gonna have some good news when I get up in the damn post office because they start to piss me off, okay? And a minute, family. Okay, family, so we are here at the post office. Let's see if we have some good news. I'll see y'all inside. Guess what, family? It's here. Woo -woo. So, family, I got my um, meet and greet invite right here on this cute little you're invited postcard situation is so cute and her name is mkb lady y'all go and subscribe to her she is awesome okay i love her lippies and all that type of stuff she's addicted to lippies kind of like i am and she's from alabama i mean y'all go up and subscribe to her because she's just she's awesome okay but i'm not going to give you guys her information and where all this stuff going to be in case there's in case there's some weirdos out there but you can contact her and all that stuff for the meet and greet information if you are in alabama you want to come hang out with us or whatever it will be saturday june 28th and i actually think that's the day i got to pick up my damn uncle so if i if it is today i gotta pick up my uncle i'm gonna try to see if i can get my mom or somebody to pick him up so i can make it because i can really um just only imagine how awesome it's gonna be hanging with you guys so i will tell you as soon as i possibly can if i'm gonna be able to attend honey but if i can't we are definitely gonna have to get up some other time because i i can already tell that it's gonna be the bomb.com hanging out with you ladies and i can only imagine you know shopping and stuff like that girl so yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to let you know what's popping on this situation right here. So y'all contact MKB lady. I will put her link and everything down in the description box below. Um, so you guys can contact her if you're in the Alabama area or if you're in the surrounding area and you wanna make it to Birmingham, Alabama. So we will be hanging out in Birmingham, Alabama, God's will. Um, and maybe you guys come hang out with us with us too. And maybe we can find some thrift stores cause I do need to find me some more thrifting spots. I wish we had to do these discounts here in Alabama, I think it's some bullshit. That's just like, you know, y'all think it's some bullshit. Y'all ain't got no dirt cheap. I think it's some bullshit. We ain't got no damn DD's discounts, okay? I'll trade y'all dirt cheap for DD's discounts. Dead for real. All day, all day, I'll trade y'all dirt cheap. <laughs> well, not really. Why can't we just split it in half, y'all? Have a half. Can we do that? Anyway, y'all contact MKB Lady if you want to hang out with us at the meet and greet that's going to be in Birmingham, Alabama on June 20. Eighth. Okay, hopefully your girl Thick Chick Vlogs will be in the house. If not, we are definitely going to have another meet and greet very, very soon. Okay, stay tuned. I will see you guys at the thrift um, store I just in a minute. stopped at this random ass store. I didn't, I didn't vlog or anything while I was at the store because it was just kind of pointless. But I, as I was vlogging or whatever, I was, you know how you get on Facebook and stuff when you're sitting in your car just chilling. When you're just out having a girl's date with yourself. But they have this um, thing. I'm pretty sure it's, on, it's, it's in everybody's city, but you may not know about it. We have this thing on my personal Facebook page um, that I'm a, a member of. It's called Tuscaloosa Anything Garage Sale. That shit is worse than a damn garage sale, family. When I say worse, I don't mean worse in a bad way. It's worse as in it, they got everything because you literally got a whole gang of people that live in the city that are just randomly selling stuff that's, you know, you don't have to necessarily go 
early one morning and look and find something. I mean, they literally post shit all day. I found these really, really cute decorative vases from this lady. They're really, really, I think it was like one, two, three, four, I need it. It's six vases, like really, really pretty decorative vases. As you guys know, my diva space, yeah, it looks like a kid role, but my, my apartment, my home, the inside of my home, it's grown up. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it in my background and stuff like that. I know you guys have, guys have complimented me on my decor and things like that in my living area. But in my diva room, it looks like a kid room, God damn it, I was just so shit, okay? But anyway, back to what I was talking about. She wanted $15 for these vases, and the only thing that was wrong with them was it had a crack in the top of one of them. And these are like some pretty tall vases, the kind that you can put like the little fake um, stem flowers and things like that in. She wanted 15 but I offered her 10 and she accepted, so I'm going to be meeting her on Friday and picking this shit up. I mean, literally, family, look, I, now this, this, this shit is too much, okay? This shit is too much, y'all doing too much, okay? Y'all doing too much. Y'all doing too much. Y'all, it's, it's me. I know it's me, but y'all can't have it, y'all. Lord, I love a deal. Y'all want to tell you, Thrifters Anonymous. Thrifters Anonymous. Y'all, okay, look. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. If I can find a good deal and it's some nice shit, as you guys know, I am picking up a treadmill on Friday as well that I found on the same exact page. Tuscaloosa Anything Garage Sale. Yes, ma'am. So if you live in Tuscaloosa or if you live in Birmingham, Houston, shit, Canada, look up Canada Garage Sale on Facebook or something. Okay. You, I'm pretty sure you'll find something that has to do with people posting their items that they don't want or anything uh, on that webpage. So y'all need to check that shit out because I found a brand new, well, it's not brand new. She said it's about two years old. But you know how people buy shit and they don't really use it. A treadmill is only two years old. It still works. It looks exactly the same as the treadmills that are in Planet Fitness. Like the same programs and everything. And it would. And she only want $90. Well, she wanted $100. But y'all know how I am. I'm a thrifter. So I have to, you know, try to get it to go lower. So I got it for $90. And I'm picking it up on Friday. So I cannot wait to, like, you know, get the exercises and things. I said, I figure I'm going to do three miles in the morning and three miles in the evening. I have no problem walking six miles. That is no problem because I did it in the gym all of the time. So, what the hell is that? I don't know what the fuck that was. But anyway. <laughs> Yeah, we're about to head up in this thrift store. I just wanted to come and say that. I'm just sitting still, sitting still at a damn store, and I'm shy. Ain't that a bitch? I ain't that some shit? Just sitting still at a store, and I'm, I'm finding shit to spend money on. I mean, it's re, re damn dickens. But anyway, I got a deal. As I said, thrifters anonymous. Thrifters anonymous. My name is Thick Chick Blogs, and I am a thrifter. I have a thrifting addiction, but guess what? I don't want no motherfucker help. Uh, no, ma'am, I don't. I don't want a motherfucker help y'all. I'm a thrifter, okay, and I love that shit. Damn it, I love this shit. Damn it, I love this shit. What the fuck are you doing with your ugly ass? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm tripping, I'm tripping, y'all. As y'all can see, I'm at American Thrift Store. I don't even know you can see that shit, y'all. But I'm at American Thrift Store. So we about to go up in here, and this probably will be the last time that you actually physically see me in this particular vlog because I'm gonna turn the camera around so you guys can see the things that I am um, finding, the treasures and things like that. You might not think they're treasure, but I do, okay? So I'm gonna be turning that camera around so you may not see my face no more, but y'all know what I look like, okay, girl? You see all this beauty? And someone asked me what um, foundation I have on. I really don't use foundation as long when it's hot or whatever. What I do have on, I have on some Black Radiance Concealer. I don't remember the color and I have on some black radiance mineral powder that is all I have on my face right now and I had on um, silver sand by Maybelline but I took it off because it started to crease and I just put on the coconut um, coconut water lip gloss that I got from Bath and Body Works that was sent to me and some love mail from my girl Miss Aloha shout out to my girl Miss Aloha Oh my goodness, these folks about to hit me. Jesus, we both doing it wrong. You you pulling in here and I'm pulling in here at the same time, girl. Girl, girl. She's sitting on some pillows too. <laughs> I clocked you, boo-boo. I clocked her ass. But yeah, so I'll see y'all inside the thrift store. Okay, so we in are at America's thrift store. I'm about to take you guys inside and we're about to see what we can find. In a minute. Okay, family, we all know that I do not need any more shoes, but these are super sexy are they not 
in there $3.99 and they're in my size size 9 you already know they are going in the basket oh that's not super sexy oh family oh my god look at these flats oh my god look at these flats these are adorable who are they by nine freaking west you know i'm trying these on oh my god hold on family family they fit they fit they are going in the bag yes ma'am see i see i, I can't i can't fuck with y'all i didn't i didn't come in here to buy nothing fucking with y'all yes i'm blaming you absolutely gorgeous and they are $4.99, but they are 50% off. So, yeah. Going in the bag. Oh my God. These are also Nine West. I need to get the hell out from over here. These are so freaking cute. Oh my God. And they're in my size. I got to try them on. Okay, I like these, but they're fitting really, really awkward. And. Mm mm. These are a no. <laughs> but they're really cute. Family. Now see, this is why I need one of y'all in here with me. So y'all can tell me, put that shit back through shit box. Look. Pito. Baby. Baby. Who are they by? Sigerson. Morrison. I don't know who the hell that is for Target. But a freaking adorable. <sighs> What y'all think? Now, family, I think these are really, really cute, but I don't think that my weight will hold these up. But that detailing is just to die for. You see that? Oh, and they're like a little heel like that. Mm -mm. But they're $4.99 with 75% off, so they would have been a steal, but it's for someone else. So we're gonna start back here in the dresses and work our way up family yes what the hell is this oh mm -mm. what do we have here pajama pants boo boo yes They changed this store around. I'm looking for the dresses. Oh, they're over here now. Okay. Found them. I think this is actually kind of cute. I know y'all may think it's ugly because you're not me, but I really think it's cute. Kind of marmish. <laughs> but I think it's cute. It's $4.99 with 50% off. So, yeah going in the bag y'all already know i'm gonna look at this shit see fucking with y'all this is the cutest little black dress for us plus size divas it's the right length and of course it's the right price oh my god look at that i'm gonna see if i can hang it you guys can see that. Mm. Mm -mm. I literally had to leave from over there because look at my freaking basket, family. <sighs> Read damn dick. I'm gonna show you guys in a second when I get somewhere where it's not a million people. And of course, shoes. <sighs> oh, y'all are a bad influence on my motherfucking life. I'm telling you. Okay, so you guys know I can just not come in here and not pick up anything right so i'm about to show y'all something this is the first piece it is a little 
flirty dress for spring. I think it's adorable. I think it's just absolutely adorable. And it's from Old Navy, as you can see. And it's $9.99, but it's 50% off. So, yeah, going in the basket. Now, this is one that I think I'm going to probably put back on the rack. It's kind of cute, but I'm still deciding. And it's six ninety nine, fifty percent 99 50% off. But it's kind of cute. But it might be a little too much for me. So, yeah. Okay, next we have this dress that I showed you guys. And it is four ninety nine, fifty percent 50% off. And it is just ugh, to die for. You can never have enough um, little black dresses in your closet. You can pair this with a nice belt. And it will just ugh, be all that in a bag of chips. So, yeah, buying it. Next is this little number. I actually love this. I know some people might think it's Marm and Little House on the Prairie, and it is. But honey, I thought it was 75% Abobo. No, ma'am, it's 90% Abobo. Gotta get it, even if I sleep in it. Love it. Now this. <sighs> yes, of course it wraps around the back. You can't really see it has a wrap around there. But church, yes ma'am, and $8.99, 50% off going in the bag and I actually think these shoes which I'm going to get will pair very well with that maybe we'll see okay the next piece is going to be this I really think that I'm gonna probably put this back I think it might be a little too tight for me in here so yeah I'll find it another day but I thought it was really really cute and it's 50% off of $3.99 so yeah I think that one's going back and of course I have these shoes which are definitely in my size and I have to get them I mean they're just oh, look at that I mean they're just adorable please and they're $3.99 50 percent off baby bye and these nine west yes yes I am mm-hmm Okay, family, since you guys are such bad influences on my life, <laughs> because y'all see what y'all made me do. Yeah, y'all made me do this shit. Y'all. And I got a crossbody, because y'all know I love crossbodies. And it's $3.99. So, I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Thumbs up if you did. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Mm, 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 mm. Thumbs up. Share this video. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Then, until the next one. See you later. Shout out to America's Thrift Store. <laughs>